ITF Daily Thoughts dated 20th February 2023 R&D product development key enabler of growth Apple sold nearly 12 billion dollars worth of AirPods during 2021 This simple and single product sales is bringing rupees 1 lakh crore revenue to the company and is still growing in double digits R&D is the key differentiator to such sustainable successes. India Inc. needs to capture the imagination on R&D and product development. Mr. Naushad Forbes highlighted the gap in the R&D spending of India Inc. and nudges our companies to focus more on this. India being the fifth largest economy ranks only the 16th in R&D spending globally. If we take industry in-house R&D, we further lag behind with a 22nd position. With just $7 billion in investments, Indian firms invest just 0.3% of GDP versus a global average of 1.5%. Every year, EU publishes the list of top 2,500 investors in R&D. The 2021 list highlights 24 Indian firms in the list versus 872 in the US, 678 in China, 233 in Japan and 114 from Germany. Even the firms ranked 24th or 25th globally spend more than all the Indian industries combined. A comparison of India and China during the period 2014 to 2021 shows a compelling picture. In R&D spending, in the pharma sector, India has gone from 8 to 11 firms in this period. In the same period, China moved from 21 to 79. In chemicals, India moved from 0 to 1, whereas China moved from 10 to 33. Auto sector, India had gone from 6 to 15, while China from 28 to 45. Mr. Forbes concludes by saying that with abundance of talent here, it is time to change our mindset and focus more on R&D. For small firms, R&D means new product development. Every company here need to derive few basic questions and work on them in the coming days. Question 1. What is the product development spend as a percentage of sales? Question 2. What is the headcount we have in the product development team and what is its performance? Question 3. The new product sales as a percentage of yearly sales and year-on-year growth. Question 4. Systems to keep a constant learning from customers to get a sense on the new needs of the market. Always product development and the success of the product development efforts lead to better gross margins versus selling only traditional products. TMITF